नमस्कार वेलकम यू ऑल इन दिस एजुकेशनल वीडियो ऑफ एन आई यू एस टूडेज सब्जेक्ट इज ई बी एस कोड नंबर फॉर दिस सब्जेक्ट इज थ्री 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 दिस इज फॉर सीनियर सेकेंडरी लेवल वी आर डूइंग लेसन नंबर फोर एंड टॉपिक ऑफ द लेसन इज शोन ऑन द स्क्रीन इट इज प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ इकोलॉजी principles means different rules and the word ecology is a kind of system in which different things are linked together in a different way so today we will be learning this lesson and this video is part 1 first we will be doing difficult words now you can see one difficult word on the screen it is larva these are the very small larvas or you can say insects it is a stage of insects just like when you have a in kitchen whenever you keep any food item which is kept for few days then after few days you can see different larvas in that food item which is kept and which is decayed so larva is the stage name in different insects this word is mineral minerals are found in different layers of the earth there are different kinds of minerals which are available you can see different names written on the screen also like phosphorus and nitrogen iron and zinc and aluminum so there are very different kinds of minerals which are available on earth all these minerals you can say many years ago or in other words you can say before christ many years before christ when the fossil fuel which was found under the earth layers so in those layers because of the time gap of so many years and the heat of the earth which is inside the earth there are many chemical reactions which occurs and resulting which results into different kinds of formation of minerals on screen you can see only few names but in reality there are various minerals available on the earth you must have seen railways so different kinds of uh, machinery or machines are made up of iron and also there are different kinds of things utensils items which are made from you uh, all these minerals different ornaments are also made using minerals like electronic items which we use at our home in those items also we use many minerals so minerals are used in many ways you can say coal petroleum oil gas all these are the items which were found inside the earth and also minerals were found inside the earth this word is moisture you all must have 
experienced whenever you open any packet of biscuits. You know, biscuit is crunchy when you buy uh, and when you open that packet just for the first time. If you keep that biscuit for a few hours, then it soaks moisture from the air or you can say soak water. So that is known as moisture. This word is adapt and adaptation. Both these are having similar meaning. One meaning is habit. When we have some habit, we do something regularly. For example, a camel. Camel is habitual of walking in sand. Whether the sun is hot or it is just normal, but the camel can easily walk on that sand. So you can say camel is adapted for that environment. And on the other hand, in another example, in cold weather, you can see the image of the bear, B-E-A-R, bear. The bear is comfortable living in a cold environment or a place where there is so much cold or ice. So similarly, there are different organisms on Earth. They have adaptation for a particular environment. So accordingly, we use this word adapt. This word is fur. Different animals have different kinds of fur. There are wild animals which have fur. Sometimes few birds also have fur. So this word is fur. This word is vegetation. Some of us may get confused with the word vegetable. So let me tell you, this word is not vegetable. This is different from vegetable. Vegetation is the name of the group of all the plants. This word is genetic. You can say that uh, we see DNA, we find DNA. All organisms which are on earth, they all have DNA or they all have some genes. Animals, plants, trees, birds, fish, human, any organism which is on earth, they all have some genetic structure. Now this image is having two different pictures. The first is deciduous and the second is evergreen. See the deciduous means when weather changes the leaves of the tree fall down. So deciduous means a tree which has leaves and those leaves fall away, fall down as the weather changes. And another word is evergreen in which the leaves remain green always. This word is geological. This is related with earth. It is something which is done for getting information or acquiring knowledge regarding earth. So this research can be on any topic which is related with earth. This word is interact. Interact involves two people when they share their thoughts they interact 
they exchange their views or they talk to each other. And similarly, in our environment, like we breathe or there are animals who also breathe, animals, birds all breathe. And also in environment, we have plants, water, river, sand. So we have exchange of so many things. Like we need food and plants give us food with the help of sun, plants prepare their food. So we all are interdependent, so we interact with each other. We give plants, we give water to plants, we give fertilizers to plant. So similarly, we are interdependent and we can say we interact in our environment. This word is physical. You can say physical has many meanings. In this context, physical means something which we can touch. Like water, we can touch water. And we can touch trees. All those things to which we can touch with our hands are known as physical. This word, science, or another word is scientific, has a kind of similar meaning. But the word scientific is used here in general. It is a way with which we do our work. This word is mutate. Earlier we had learnt the word DNA and the genetic. So it is a word which is used in the context of genes. Let me explain. Like there are different flowers which are around us in the environment. And if their DNA is changed or their main structure is changed, then the new mutated organism which we get may have some other genes or you can say that is a new mutated gene. So similarly it can be done in any organism. Naturally, when we try to mutate any gene, it can be done in any species. And when it is mutated, we get a different structure of the gene altogether. This word is offspring. It means baby. Like all animals have babies. Birds also have babies. And we human also have babies. So all the animals which are on earth, they all have babies. So this word is used for the same meaning. This word is variation in birds. Variation means something different in all those members of a group. So on screen you can say different birds having different kinds of beaks. Thank you. Namaste.